I'm Kimberly Kay with your entertainment report from MidHudsonNews.com. The National Society of Film Critics has selected Amour as the best picture of 2012. The critics chose the star of Amour, Emmanuel Riva, as the best actor, and Daniel Day-Lewis was chosen as best actor for Lincoln. The group of 60 prominent movie critics from around the country met Saturday at Lincoln Center in New York City to make its picks. Austrian director Michael Haneke won best director for for Amour, the French language film depicts the slow deterioration of an elderly woman played by Riva. Playwright Tony Kushner won Best Screenplay for Lincoln. Amy Adams was chosen Best Supporting Actress for The Master. And Matthew McConaughey was selected Best Supporting Actor for Magic Mike and Bernie. Well, after years of seeming that he didn't like Jay Leno, David Letterman now says he's the funniest guy he's ever known. He tells Oprah Winfrey that Leno's nightclub act is, quote, the smartest. He calls Leno a wonderful observationist and very appealing as a comic. At the same time, Letterman says Leno might also be the most insecure person he's ever known. The interview airs Sunday on OWN. George Lucas is engaged. He proposed to Melody Hobson, who's the president of an investment firm. They've been dating six years. No wedding date has been announced. Hobson is 43. Lucas is a quarter century older. Patrick Dempsey might now be in the coffee business. He's bought Tully's Coffee at a bankruptcy auction for $9.2 million. It's kind of a lot for a bankruptcy auction. Starbucks was competing for the small coffee chain, too. Dempsey is excited about beating Starbucks. He tweets that he met the green monster, looked her in the eye, and she blinked. Starbucks says, not so fast. It's joining with another bidder to offer $10.6 million, about $1.5 million more than Dempsey. The winning bid won't be determined until a court hearing on January 11th. In local entertainment news, the Pete Levin Trio Jazz Brunch at the Falcon is happening. It's Pete with Bob Reich and Jeff Siege Siegel at the favorite Hudson Valley Jazz venue. They're at, at their breakfast burrito and a Bloody Mary, and you've got your Sunday groove. It's live at the Falcon, which is at 1348 Route 9W in Marlboro. The fun begins at 1030 a.m. That's your latest entertainment report for a new update daily. Log on to MidHudsonNews.com. I'm Kimberly Kay.